Okay, hey guys, um, I'm back, I guess. Um, I apologise for taking absolutely forever to ever come back. I know I haven't done any videos in a long, long time. Um, but I'm going to do an explanation for that any minute now. Trust me, it's a good one. It really is the best explanation I've ever had. Um, right, first things first, yeah, I've had my hair cut a little bit. It is still me, I promise. Um, Alright, other things. Uh, let's see. Uh, subscribers. First of all, I want to say hello to all my subscribers. Uh, say hi to all my new ones. How are you doing? Um, it's been nice to see over the last few months that a few more people have been subscribing. Um, I'll be honest, I haven't been having a look around YouTube as much as what I probably should be. Uh, but every now and again I've checked in and it's been really, really nice to see that I've got a lot of new subscribers. So. Uh, and to all the old ones who have been waiting probably forever for that review that I promised I was going to do, I apologise, but... So, uh, explanation, where have I been? Right, well, I would imagine that anyone who's seen my previous videos, I mentioned that my wife was pregnant with our second child. Um, I think, at the time, I'm trying to remember when that review was. Uh, I think it was about th three months into the pregnancy, something like that. Well, anyway, after that last review, all hell broke loose. Um, we ended up with a lot of problems with the midwives. Um, a lot of problems in the pregnancy. My wife was struggling a little bit. Um, couldn't figure out why, because, you know, the first pregnancy were a bit rough. You know, no worse than anybody else's. Um, well, anyway, we managed to get that under control. Managed to try and get the stress things under control and that kind of thing. Uh, and then things went disastrously wrong. Uh, ten weeks left to go. Out of nowhere, my wife gave birth to my son ten week early. Um, completely and utterly out of the blue. Got absolutely no idea how that exactly happened. All we know is that there was ten weeks left to go, and she was having one of those days where she was in a lot of pain, and you know we assumed it was this and that. And out of nowhere, um, she started screaming, and I thought something seriously wrong. She said, I think I'm in labour. I'm like, okay, let me check. Yeah, you're in labour. What's it called? He's crowning quick. <laughs> so, not very much time to do anything. Um, cut a long story short, she had birth on the floor and I was the one that delivered him. So, which, you know, pretty cool. That's awesome. Only if didn't actually realize that that was a very, very long time. He was in a state. He was at the beginning. He ended up in the He ended up. He was there. Uh, hi. We had a night. To cut a long story short, but basically saying we don't know if he's going to make it through the night. So that was a little bit scary. And we had pretty much the worst night of our lives that night, but. He made it through that, then a couple of weeks later he had another complication which, again, we thought we were going to lose him, but lo and behold, he had managed to make it through. We had a lot of problems along the way, but the one thing I can absolutely tell you is it's fine, and oh, here he is, this is my little man. Like I said, this is our second one. Um, our first one will not sit still to go on camera, so I can't really ever show you him. But this is our little fella. It's him. Hello. Hello. Hey, you. Hey, you. What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh. Hello. You say hello to everybody. You say hello to everyone. Yeah. Oh. You're going to help Daddy do this review. We should probably do a review. I think that's what people are looking at this video for, don't you? You think we should do a review? Do you think? Yeah, you do. You want to help with a review? What shall we do then? Shall we pick a pick a review for everybody to watch? What shall we do? Shall we do... Ooh, what's this one? <gasps> what's this one that Daddy's got? What's this one that Daddy's got? Ooh, does that smell nice? Does that smell nice? Well, anyway, everybody can see. This is my little. He's now months old. When he came, it was uh, three pounds. <laughs> now he can't see. Can he? What's my? He's a cat. 
I'm really hoping I would okay. I should hope so. Definitely sure. I think mean, I do. So, guys, I agree. But, we're going to have to do a review now, kid. We are. We are. Right, today we're going to be doing this one. That is Rainwashed Berries. Rainwashed Berry, sorry, not Berries, Berry. It's uh, part of a Simply Home range. Picked this up in, well, the months he was in the hospital. We were getting that stressed out. We ended up using pretty much every Yankee tart that we'd got new. So I'm struggling what to show you guys. I've got lots more coming. I am going to be getting more. I've still got tons more to review older ones. I'm just hoping to do a few newer ones. But we got that stressed out. Every single night we're having to use those, weren't we? Yeah, we were. Because you kept scaring us. Yes, you did. Yes, you did. You kept scaring us. You kept scaring us. Oh. Oh, shall we sit you up there a little bit? Shall we sit you up there? I'm going to get no work done, am I? No work done. Right, so, Rainwash Berry. It's been a while since I've actually had this on, so you're going to have to bear with me for the smell. Oh. Are we not happy? Are we not happy? Is it because I'm not talking to you? Is it because I'm not talking to you? Mm. Do you want Daddy to finish this review on his own? Do you want me to finish the review on my own? Yeah? I'll finish it on my own then. Mwah. Go on then, my little man. Oh, don't worry, I'll tell the folks he said bye. Alrighty, so, Rainwash Berry. <laughs> okay. This is a bit where everybody sort of stops tuning in now and goes, hang on a minute, bring back the kid. Don't want to hear you, just bring back the baby. <laughs> So, very much berry, yep. Yeah. First impressions, it is, to me, it smells spicy. It smells like a spice. It just does. I don't know if you've noticed, by the way, I'm actually looking at the camera more. If you've seen my other videos, my eyes are everywhere. But I'm getting better. So, like I said, a spicy smell kind of mix. I don't know, you know, like that sort of, it does actually smell like fresh rain. Um, you know that kind of smell when it smells after rain? I've done this before in other videos. So for this, it's got a spicy berry smell. I don't remember berries being that spicy when I've actually smelled them, but this is really nice, actually. In fact, um, for the last week or two, I've actually been experimenting with this one. Um, I'm going to be doing mixologies anyway. Um, I'm going to try and squeeze in as many as I can. Obviously, I don't have as much time to do them as much as I was, um, but I will be doing them. Like I said, I am actually back. So that is Rainwash Berries. It is really, really nice. It's quite strong. Um, I mean, I put a, a... Well, pretty much how much you can see missing out of there, if you can actually see that. Whatever's missing out of that is pretty much how much I put into the thing. And it stunk the house out. Every, every room you went in, you could smell it. The only way to get away from it was lock yourself in an upstairs bedroom and shut the doors. And even then there was a, a, a scent of it floating about. But that is really, really nice. Like I say, it's a spicy kind of fresh smell. It is slightly fruity. I'd say it's that fruity. I think the spice is overpowering it a little bit. But that's not a complaint at all. I mean, you know me, I love my spicy ones. So, I mean, I could be wrong. I mean, some people might agree, uh, disagree with me on that one. If you can smell fruit in there, comment. But yeah, that is Rainwash Berry, and it is absolutely beaut. So yeah, what's it called? The Simply Home ones. Um, there's been a couple where I've had problems with them before, and a couple where, you know, they've not really been my thing. But that is really, really strong. That is really nice. If you're wanting to, uh, to stink out your entire house with something really spicy, I'd go with that. Definitely. I say I've. It reminds me of something else. This one, I can't remember for the life of me which one, but it's one of the uh, one of the spicy numbers. It kind of reminds me a little bit of Red Velvet. I say if anybody's uh, seen a Red, if we've got a Red Velvet review, I think I have. Yeah, I have. Um, if you've seen that, I say it's. I would imagine it's got a slight scent of that. But again, people are going to completely disagree with me. I say you got to uh, apologise. What's it called? Baby brain. If you believe that, you believe anything. Um, so yeah, that's Rainwash Berries. Um, like I said, I'm really sorry I took so long to come back. Um, obviously, like I said, it's been one of those, one of those years. So 
But I figured I would come back and start doing it again. Um, like I said before to all my subscribers, thank you very much for still tuning in. Hopefully you still want to watch my videos and you haven't got fed up waiting for me. Um, there will be more. I've still got plenty more tarts to review. Um, just not so much for newer ones at the minute. But that's not a problem. I will just carry on doing it. And I've got a couple of mixologies as well. So, in fact, I think I've got about five or six mixologies to do. So, I will get those on as soon as possible. So, uh, thank you again for tuning in. I will see you on the next video. Um, you never know what's it called. The baby might appear again. You never know. I say, I don't think my other son's ever going to appear, though. In fact, I should probably change my name as well. It's Yankee King and Son. It's Sons now. <laughs> One of them's going to be taking offence sooner or later. So, uh, but yeah, I'm rambling. I apologise. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you all on that next review.